Salt loses its flavor when it remains in the salt jar. When members discover that the mission of church has moved from what it is, they soon discover this is not a refuge for their own souls and they live with the, using the very door that they have used to come in. I went through the Adventist archives and I find Anthony Kent who serves us in the general conference as the associate ministerial secretary. He therefore cites three top reasons why members don't feel, un, don't feel comfortable anymore to sit in our pews. The main reason that he speaks about there he says that people are tired of hypocrisy amongst members. In the pursuit of self-righteousness, we have self-appointed assistant Jesus, as I call them, who believe that they have a red pen, that while we are chopping some trees, their business is to look at those who are chopping trees. They are not here to chop or to make any difference. They are only here to deter and disturb those who are busy chopping. Because they can quote some spirit of prophecy and some Bible text. Because they believe that they own and understand church policy. They use all these things to deter the church from its own mission. Which is to saving souls for the kingdom. The second reason that he cites is that marital problems are, is the second reason that makes the church lose its membership. It is true because God got this clear a long time ago. In the days of patriarchs and in the days of the Bible as we were talking about, the church was not a hall somewhere full of individuals. The church was a man and his family. And now it is very clear that when the what is really church, when the family unit is breaking in pieces, so should be the church that they belong to. The last reason, and it pains my heart, it comes back again in a different way. He says, members are leaving the church when they discover that there is a lot of conflict within the church of God. Who are these? In the mission of saving lives, in the mission of saving people for the kingdom, who have brought certain things that are related to the mission of God, but are not the mission of God. Things that must find attention and everything must stop so that we discuss issues. With no intention to save anyone, with no intention to become the salt of the earth or the light of the city, but meetings seek to discuss nothing and nothing. And he says, for these reasons, they are deciding to leave the church. Therefore, today the Lord has impressed in my heart to talk to you about what happens, or rather the experiences we have right here of becoming soldiers because the church of God, it is a hospital for sinners. Are we together, friends? But you need to be careful in your understanding of this hospital it is a hospital where nurses themselves are patients. It is a hospital where the doctor themselves need to stop and be evaluated themselves. This is a hospital for sinners and nothing else. Therefore, even though we may differ with the degrees of our sickness, the truth is all of us are in need of the Savior. 